Hey ladies, it's Deanna from thelivefitgirls.com and today we have a full body booty band workout. I know you love these booty band workouts. They are one of my favorites too. So grab your booty band and let's get started. I would recommend a heavier booty band for this workout today. I'm using extra heavy today, medium heavy, extra heavy, whatever you've got. Challenge yourself because it's only a 15 minute workout. This workout is part of a little series I've put together for you proving that you only need 15 minutes to get in an amazing workout. You don't need to spend an hour in the gym. 15 minutes is fine if that's all you've got. You just need targeted workouts to keep moving and just keep going. Consistency is key. This workout is part of the Fitness Collective, my app that has over 150 full length workouts just like this. So if you like this workout, make sure you check it out. There's a two week free trial down below where you can try it out and see just how amazing those workouts are. Now, let's get started. So let's get our band on. We're gonna put it just above our knees on our thighs here, and we'll start with some squats here. So feet about shoulder width apart here, maybe a little bit turned out here, and then from here, just lower down into a squat, right back up, down and up. Weight in those heels. Sit those hips back like you're sitting into a chair. Squeeze those glutes at the top and make sure you're pressing into that band so that you're feeling those outer thighs work. You wanna keep tension on that band always today. That is what is going to work those muscles harder and really engage all of those muscles in your total body. Let's go for five, four, three, two, Last one, lower it right back down, hold it here. Now, little opens up on that band for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and up. Whew. Keep that band right where it is and come on down for a plank. Hands right underneath those shoulders and then sit those feet out. Feet a little wider today just to get that resistance on the band. Shoulders away from those ears. We're here for 30 seconds. Big inhales and exhales. Lengthening through the crown of the head. Soft little bend in the elbows. Shoulders away from those ears. Lengthening out through the crown of the head and through those heels. Nice job. Soft bend in those elbows for three, two, one, and down. Whew. All right. Quick warm up, so we're getting right into it here. So we are gonna be doing alternating squats side to side, stepping out. So those feet are gonna start narrow or kind of hip distance apart. Remember, keep that tension on the band. Do what feels right with those arms here. Doesn't really matter, hands on the hips. You can move them with you, hands behind the head, whatever feels right. Let's go out in three, two, one. Out, up, other side, and up. So just working those outer thighs here as you're stepping out. Focus on still keeping the right form with those legs here. And you want your weight equal between those feet as you step it out. So you're not kind of like sliding off into one side too much. You're staying equal through those feet, but getting that outer thigh work as you step it out. This one will get your heart rate up a little too, which is always a plus. Two more each side, you can do it, come on. Last one on each side, and up. All right, keep the band right where it is. We're gonna come right on down onto our backs here for a little core work. And we're gonna go right into some crisscrosses here. So, hands come behind your head, legs come up into tabletop, twist towards me. That front knee is gonna stay right where it is, come center, other side. Slow and controlled here, that's the name of the game for this one. Belly flattening as that leg reaches out. <sighs> Feel the low abs pulling in, pelvic floor muscles pulling in nice and tight here. <sighs> You've got it. making sure that you're thinking rib towards the opposite hip, not just elbow to knee. Three more on each side. Come on, you can do this. This targets that whole core. Those obliques, those upper abs, those lower abs. 
One more on each side. <sighs> Hug those knees in for a second. Give that low back just a little bit of love. And we'll take that band off for the next exercise. This probably takes the longest time. And then we are gonna come over and do a set of push-ups. So you're gonna put your band around your arms just above your elbows. If you are not the greatest at push-ups, this will actually help assist you, which is nice. So you can do these on your knees if you need to, but I do encourage you to try them on your toes because you will get a little extra boost from that band here. Elbows are gonna stay nice and narrow. You're gonna find a nice, beautiful plank position. You can go a little wider with those feet for a little extra support if you need it. We're only doing 10 here. You're gonna lower it down, push right back up. And again, you'll notice that band kind of helping you to get right back up there. You've got this. Halfway already, you can do it. Just five, four, three, Come on, two more. Last one. And down, that is it. Those are our three exercises and we are gonna get right back into it. Placing that band just above those knees, alternating squats side to side here. You ready? Let's go in three, two, one. Out, up, and other side. You got it. Three rounds of all of these, you can do it. Again, keeping moving here, making sure we're getting that total body worked, keeping the weight in the heels for this one. Again, doing what feels right with those arms. You can do whatever feels right for you. Stepping it out, keeping tension on that band the whole time. Two more each side, come on, push through that discomfort. Last one each side. And down. All right, come on down to your mat. We've got those crisscrosses. Let's get those core muscles nice and engaged here. Legs to tabletop. Re adjust that band if needed. Hands come behind your head. Rotate it towards me. Extend that opposite leg out. Slowly switch. Take your time here. This is not a race. This one is about control. <sighs> flattening that belly deeper each and every repetition for this one. The lower the legs go, the more you're gonna work the hamstrings and the booty, and the more you'll challenge that core engagement. Three, keep it up ladies. Two more each side. Belly flattening deeper, one more each side. And rest for a second. Whew. All right, hug those knees in. While you're down here, take that band off. We have got those push-ups. All right, come on up. Again, we're putting that band around our elbows here to give us that little boost. And again, I challenge you to try these on your toes today if that is not something that you normally do. It does give you that extra little boost, I swear. If you don't believe me, try it and see. Here we go, just 10 of these. I know you can do it. Let's go in three, two, one. Down, push it up. Down, press. Stay strong with your core. Breathe through it, exhale to press. Just five, four, three more, two, Last one, and down, whoo, those get you. Even though you have that little assistance there, they are still challenging, but again, doable, which is nice. That little extra help there from the band. Sometimes bands aren't always bad, right? No, I, we love the bands around here. You ladies love the bands. They are amazing for so many things. Let's go, round number three, let's do it. You ready? All right, three, two, one. Out and up, out and up. <sighs> Weight in those heels, powering up through the backs of the legs, squeezing those glutes at the top. <sighs> Come on, stay strong with me this last round. I know you can do it. 
I know it gets tough. I believe in you. Believe in yourself. You can do hard things. <sighs> to each side, come on. <sighs> Keeping that resistance. Last one each time. <sighs> and done. Whew. Okay, we are done with those squats. Again, that one gets your heart rate up just a little bit, which is nice. All right, come on down. Last round of core here. Legs are gonna come up to that tabletop position. Hands come behind the head. Readjust that band. Now again, making sure you have tension on that band, even here before we start. Hands behind your head, twist towards me. Extend that other leg out and switch. Switch. <sighs> Rotating through that spine. <sighs> Neck is nice and long. Lengthening out through that straight leg. <sighs> Come on, you can do it. <sighs> Just four. <sighs> Draw those low abs in deeper for three. <sighs> Two more each side. Come on. Nice and controlled. Last one each side. <sighs> and rest. Ooh, oh my gosh. All right, take that band off from those legs. We've got those push-ups and we will stretch everything out. Whew. Proud of you for pressing play today. Always the hardest part, but once you're finished, you will feel so, so amazing here. Band comes up, again, just above those elbows. Last 10 push-ups here, you can do it. I know you can. Challenge yourself. If you haven't tried full push-ups yet, please, 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 last round, try it for me. I know you can do it. Here we go, in three, two, one. Down, press. Down, press, come on. Long spine here, looking to the very front edge of your mat. Five, four more. Three, two, last one, come on. Push and down, whoo. Oh my gosh, you did it. So proud of you. Let's take a little stretch. We are going to stretch with our band today since we've got it. Take a little hamstring stretch here. Place that band around the arch of your foot. Find like a little figure four here. Bottom of that foot is pressed against the inner thigh here. Sit up nice and tall and then pull in with that band. Getting a nice stretch in the back of the leg. Big inhales and exhales, breathing through it. Shoulders down your back. You're getting like a little isometric row in those arms too, a little extra bonus. Again, you know I love little bonuses here. Bring it forward, switch sides. Around the arch of that foot. Bottom of that foot is gonna go to the inner thigh of that working leg or that stretching leg. Pull it in here. Nice tall spine, see if you can Lengthen up through the crown of the head. <sighs> Pull a little bit more flexing through that foot, getting deeper into that stretch. Shoulders down your back. Again, that isometric little contraction through the upper body. <sighs> Release it. All right, come on up and stand. We're gonna do a little tricep stretch here. So I'm gonna turn around, you're gonna drape that band behind you and then from here grab onto it with the other hand you're going to pull down with the bottom arm to get a nice stretch in the triceps in that top arm keep that elbow reaching up towards the sky here big inhales and exhales and then from here just reverse it so bend the bottom arm and pull the top arm up and you're going to get a nice stretch for this one in the front of that shoulder. So the front of that opposite shoulder that you were just getting that tricep stretch in. <sighs> Deep breaths here. And then bend that top arm, release it. And again, same thing on the other side. Triceps first, you're gonna drape that band down. Now from here, straighten out the bottom arm so you'll get that stretch in the top arm in those triceps, the back of that upper arm. 
Big inhales and exhales. One more breath here. Both shoulders away from the ears and then release the bottom arm. Pull up through that top arm to get that stretch in the front of the shoulder. So that front shoulder of that stretching arm. Big inhales and exhales. Release it and then bring it down. Again, I am so proud of you for showing up today. You did an amazing job. You put yourself first. Again, 15 minutes is all you need for an amazing workout. I'll see you next time.